Let's get back to Flying Warriors. We last left Rick in the middle of a gloomy cave filled with bats. So many bats. And boulders. So many falling rocks. And a strange statue, which you should not break. Do not break the statue! It will kill you with poisoned gas. I broke the statue. It was a foolish thing to do, but kind of funny. Because I died. Unless you have more than 255 hit points, then I guess you can get away with it. Take that wall. It's a long fall, so I will punch the wall. Punch and kick. Punch and kick the wall. These monsters are strange. Do not let their strangeness deter you. You can block their shots if you are skillful. Or just lucky, in my case. Hooah! It's fun to get around using that special kick. Oh, that fall isn't as long. And a demon! Which we have quickly defeated. But it becomes a tusk soldier, which is the typical thing for demons to do. Your legions will soon be defeated. Transform! Aha! Oops. You did the wrong kind of block. This fight should be relatively easy. Oh, let me get the water. Hooray! I managed to still... I still managed to get the water. Despite the fact that I had been punched. Or kicked in the stomach, I think. That's what happened at the time. Howling fire! Sure, the other spells may be more powerful, but Howling Fire just looks the coolest. It's the only one that's directed. It comes right out of his hand. It's like a handheld flamethrower. Fire Tornado is super cool too, but. It starts in the middle of the screen. It's like just some spell. Feels like it's coming out of nowhere. It just doesn't have the same feel. That's howling fire. More potion. I think nine is max. I'm not sure though. Maybe it's ten. I forget. It's been a while. You defeated the Tusk Soldier, and gained 1,200 experience. And the Mirror of Earth, which is what the orb was blinking out, all out of control about. The KO Gauge. The Knockout Gauge. The Ko Gauge. No, it's not the Ko Gauge. Hey now. It's not nice. Challenging me at this moment. Money! I'm gonna drink one of these. Mud men! Mud men have mud money. Oh, 
Aw, my KO game. That's more like it. You won't take away my KO gauge. You bees. Aw, the skeletons took my KO gauge away. Then they will have to give it back. Much better. Oh no you don't. I want to keep this KO gauge. Being able to shoot is a nice bonus. Oh, great. Well, so much for that. That's kind of convenient. Ow. Okay, that energy bear... That bear made out of pure energy... There's something deadly about it. A bear made out of pure energy, and I don't understand what. Okay, I got that drink prematurely. That is not going to be a good thing, I don't think. The Sword of Mayuri? I pronounced that wrong. The Sword of something or other. Uh, I gotta learn how to pronounce that. What was that? Sword of... It's not there. Oh, it's equipment. Hee <laughs> hee. Rick gave it to somebody else. Mayuri. Huh, I think I did say it right. Alright. Can't be a coward forever. Or can we? No, I don't see how we'll accomplish anything doing that. Alright, time to go down and face the bear. Run away! You know, we don't really need to kill the bear. I don't think it gives us anything. I'm just going to agree to disagree with the bear. Oh god, this isn't much of an improvement. But it is, I know how to fight this one. That wasn't so bad. Especially with our increased power these days. The Trident of Leva. The Mirror of Jupiter. We're getting all sorts of weird stuff. All sorts of ancient knickknacks. I'm gonna open up my own antique shop. No, actually, I think we're supposed to save the world with this stuff. But if we can open up an antique shop, we'd make a tidy little profit, too. This place is full of crazy claws that shoot bugs, some sort of grubs, or larva. And magic water. Magic water's good. And what's over here? Over here is Statue Man. Ow. He kicked me out. Literally, he kicked me out of the screen. Like, I've been kicked out of places before, but never quite so literally. Ow. That is annoying and painful. Alright, we've dealt with you before. Super aggression, I don't care. We're gonna get through this. 
of Kundari. Kundari. That's what you have to say when you kill someone with the axe. Oops. I thought that was one of those pits that you could, like, crap. Okay, well, we're back here. Kundari. I, th I thought it wasn't, it was like one of those non-death pits. I wasn't, I was not paying attention. It's like you come across that screen a lot. Let's break the statue. No. No, no. You are a good statue. We'll just gently, gently push him to the side. That statue is a good statue. Stupid wall. Take out my frustrations on you.